It's easy. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, because my, my brother is a cellist and, and my lot. my mother she is a mm -hmm. choir conductor and that's why I'm musician. <laughs> first, uh, actually, uh, first. So it was determined for you. Yeah, yeah. Uh, you know, like first five, ten years, I I didn't understand what. Uh, <laughs> it's heritage. Yeah, and but yeah, after. For me, there is no, no one in my family musician, and I'm the first one. Yeah. And uh, when I went to grammar school, my teacher was a music teacher, and he recommended that I, I was a big girl as a, a six-year-old. So I was big, and he recommended that I start cello. Cello, you fall in love with cello. I didn't really, but it became my life. Ah. <laughs> oh. I like, I like being on the stage, mm -hmm. and I like um, when people feel what I uh, feel with my music, mm -hmm. and I I can. I can see that they are um, concentrating on my music, and when I play alone, but when, well, even when I play with someone else, like you know, Vladimir, and I, I, I like making music together and give our feeling to the audience. It is for you <laughs> when you play with the right emotion when you very good feel music public uh, give you back uh, energy yeah it's really important for 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 us actually because uh, you well, first you like love music but another thing is that you can just love, love it at home you, you need to uh, what do you give to people? Give to people, yeah. And if you doing right, uh, people give you back energy. Yeah. And, uh, with the applause and with, uh, the, with, with the way they react. Know, with the silence. Yeah. With silence. Yeah. Yes. Not with the applause. You know, <laughs> applause. It's okay. It's okay. But yeah, but when you have a silence, it's must uh, must. We, in, uh, yeah, I feel the that my music is the. the Public audience is observing my music. Yeah, because they are they are paying attention yeah, yeah. about what you're playing or what you're doing. Mm -hmm. Okay. We should play like one. Like one. Yeah, yeah it's the same we way that you prefer. We should be together like one, because it's uh, we just spoke about it. It's uh, really fun. Uh, but usually a double concerto it's like. Yeah, walking in park for a musician. Oh, okay. It's not too hard. Not hard for you. It's not too hard, but Brahms double concerto, it's really hard. <laughs> it's very difficult. It's very difficult. <laughs> Technical, musical, everything emotional, and actually it's hard physically. Yeah. Because if, if for example, the hole so big, like, like you have, uh, you should be always, you know. And it's big and sold out, it's gonna be. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Under pressure. Yeah. <laughs> and, yeah, Brahms. So you prefer it as solo, and then you have to share the emotions of the way you're gonna play or you're gonna perform? In, in a moment, I think, when you are in rehearsal, you have to. How can I explain to do something for that be, become two of you become one? But you know, I I met him yesterday. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yesterday. <laughs> but well, after uh, practicing together half an hour, I immediately felt that our music, our emotion um, is. Same. The same. Yeah, we feel the same. Some some people, I, I cannot play together mm -hmm. because we the, the the way of expression and the way of um, feeling music is so different. Mm -hmm. But with him, I'm very comfortable. Yeah, so. I feel the same. Yeah. Totally. Mm -hmm. I.
can I say to another thing? Because now I have time of my life, I live in Switzerland, in Bern, and uh, Brahms uh, wrote its concert in Thun. It's a small, small village near the Bern, and I was there when I started to uh, practice uh, this concert. Mm -hmm. And Brahms wrote this piece in, in Thun, yeah, and I was there, and I tried to feel what uh, what he feels this moment. What what he wants to. What he wants. What what he saw around. What he uh, feel with nature, weather, uh, mountains, lake, mm -hmm. everything. And you can you can take it for 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 your. Music interpretation. Okay, yeah. for your performance. Yeah. No, I think this concerto is very important. I feel um, all the emotions of life within one piece of composition. Like um, Brahms wrote it uh, for his friend, violinist friend. Mm -hmm. They had, um, they were very good friends, but somehow they became very like not friend for a while then Brahms wrote it as a um, to approach uh, to gain his friendship back so the second movement is like we play unison together and third movement is very joyful and happiness and so I when I play I, I feel those emotions of life okay. I mean I, I I adapt that to my life, those feelings, and you know, I, I just love, love Brahms. Wow. Yeah, wow. really. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. <laughs> <laughs> Can you invite our audience to come to this? Yeah.